Hey guys, there's my three-year-old Peruvian apple cactus that I started from cutting about <laughs> three years ago. It's about foot tall when I got it as a cutting. There's my Hoya Wyeti that was struggling inside, and I thought for sure it was going to die when I threw it out here, but it is loving life, and it has quadrupled in size. There's one of my Monsteras that's getting a new leaf, and you'll recognize those variegated agaves from one of my first videos. Those are all pups I took from the mama plant, and that cactus right there was a cutting that my cats gave me when they knocked a few pads off of one of my plants. And all these monsteras were in my house. They were struggling. I really have an issue watering because I'm a succulent lover. So when it comes to tropicals and stuff like that, I have a hard time remembering to water them. So they're really loving life out there sunk in the fountain and I don't have to remember to water them. So it's a, it's a plus plus. That's a new leaf that made me decide to record this video. It got me all excited. And all these plants were at one time struggling. You can see it from the scars. But they are now thriving and they are living life. And I even have some frogs that live in there. Unfortunately, they're out and about probably eating all sorts of insects. But I just wanted to share my fountain. And maybe you can share your fountains with me and some of your experiences. You look at all those glorious roots. Those are all brand new from when I sunk them in the in the fountain. I love it. It keeps the water clean and the frogs swim around in there when it gets too hot. So remember, bloom where you're planted.